gamers. Gamers. Hello, folks. Uh, my name's Beth. This is another Super Sharp Shooter show, and I quickly wanted to talk you through this. Uh, so we can start, this time you've spawned on the stairs, but no matter where you spawn, get to the stairs. And when you get to the stairs, get up to the second floor, the top floor, as fast as you can. Running is fine. Uh, in the first five minutes, there won't be any goons, and the PMCs, well, they'll be busy, I don't know, doing PMC things. So we've got to get to the top floor as fast as we humanly can. Once we're on the top floor, which is now, we're going to try and find either the two loot rooms or the circular room. Looks like the circular room is right there, so we'll probably just hit this and get out. Run in, check the place. There you go. Instantly want that. That's the currency converter. Take that. It's rubbish. I'll take that. It's rubbish. I'm not going to search that box. Don't have time. I want to stand out there in the open on that circular thing. There's a death trap. In here, this room we will search. We'll have time. We'll shut the door so we can't be seen. I have been killed both by in here and out in that circle room. The only places I've died on this run. So the spawns here can be the loot spots here on the shelf. Sometimes on the floor there. I'll take the I think I've got time to take the computers in this room. I feel safe and I do the computers and the shelves, but uh, certainly in all the other rooms I don't open anything like this. Now, that currency converter, it's important to note that it's a four space item. So if you came here uh, in just your underpants or without a bag or without a tack rig that can take a four space item you'd be kicking yourself you've finally got this item that you need to get your solar power for your hideout and you can't carry it home because you haven't bought a big enough attack rig so I don't need a gun I can smash the windows with my axe uh, I'm not going to get into any fight if I get into a fight I'm dead so we church the shelves here very important though Um, the computers are pretty good. I get the spawn rate on graphics cards in these computers is high. It's not letting me stash any of that stuff. It does let me stash, uh, you know, my secret up your bum stash. It does let me stash graphic cards, but ninja figurines. So yeah, I have. I usually search all these computers. I have been killed while searching these computers, and I had the far forward GPS in my hand for the first time ever in however many wipes of my three or four wipes that I've played. It was the first time I'd ever had that and then uh, I got shot by a guy down below. But nonetheless I'm pretty confident. Now the way out, the way to leave, we're about ready to go now, is to shoot the glass behind us and drop down to the floor if we do that just right, we, hit, we land on the top of the door, we don't break our legs. If we do it wrong, we break our legs. But if we bounce off that door, don't break our legs. Broken legs or not, this is still the fastest way to do it. Hit this switch. It's right at the bottom of the steps. Often forget that. Straight across to here. Open this door. Turn left. Out the other door. And there's the lift. This took a bit of practice. I learnt this in offline mode. In, uh, you know, in practice runs with no with no AI and then I realized that practice runs with AI is exactly the same as what you're gonna get in a PvE run exactly so I practiced it for no loss no reward a couple of times and learnt this run after 12 attempts at this run I'd got three currency converters Two, I picked up two F GPS's, but I died with one in my hand. I got up with one GPS, three graphics cards, two converters.